I'm going to decorate these cupcakes with just a very, very simple um, piping using a star tip uh, in a pastry bag. Before I go ahead and decorate the cupcakes, I want to show you a couple of tips on uh, using the pastry bag properly. The whole key to getting a really nice smooth icing is understanding how to use pressure and release in your bag. So you'll notice that I'm twisting this up really, really tight, which means that I can get a lot of pressure very, very easily just using one hand. You don't want to hold your bag like this because you'll warm up the buttercream uh, from, your, from just the warmth of your hands and it'll make it runny. So you want to have a lot of pressure up at the top so that just a tiny, tiny squeeze with your fingers will get that buttercream to come out. If your uh, pastry bag doesn't have that tight twist to it and it's just loose, all when you go to squeeze it, you're going to have to squeeze much harder and all of that buttercream is going to creep out the top there. So you just want to make sure you have that really, really nice and tight at the top. The best way to practice pressure and release in your pastry bag is to create stars. So we're going to start out with a sheet of parchment paper, our uh, pastry bag set up with a star tip. I always have a towel to clean off my tip so that I get a nice clean line. We're going to start with the pastry bag straight up and down at a 90 degree angle. And we're going to hover the uh, bag about a quarter of an inch off of the paper and we're going to squeeze until we have the size we want, release all the pressure, and come up. So we're going to squeeze, release, and come up. Squeeze, release, and come up. Squeeze, release, and come up. If you don't do the release part, you'll end up with not a star, but sort of a point. So you want to make sure that before you lift your bag off of that paper, you've released all the pressure and come up. So squeeze, release, and up. And then what we want to do is just get a row of stars that are all about the same size and all the same shape. So just go ahead and practice that and then we'll go and decorate our cupcakes. We have our cupcakes and we're going to utilize that exact same method that we just did for the stars, but we're going to do a continuous uh, rope of the buttercream around the top of our cupcakes. So we're going to start at the edge here and we're going to do the pressure all the way around. Keep applying that pressure. Don't let up on the pressure until you get to the center and then we release the pressure and up and that gives you a really nice smooth coating of the buttercream. So go all the way around. I'm using a fairly small star tip. You could use a much larger star tip to do this as well. And that's it. That's how we're gonna get a really nice base of buttercream. And then we could leave it at this or put sprinkles on here or even add a icing rose to the top of this. And that's it. Just keep the pressure really nice and even. And then at the very end, release that pressure. And I'm not squeezing this bag. I just actually have my fingertips on the, on the bag here just to steady it as I go. And that's it. One last one and we're all set. And so you have a very nice, clean cupcake to work with. And you can either leave it like that, or now we can go ahead and decorate it with even more icing.